What I've learned most being here is kind of how to take pride in myself and how to be more comfortable in my own skin, which was weird because I came here and I felt pretty, pretty darn comfortable. But I saw so many amazing things like that. We did a really cool swim and so many people were so like, positive with their body, it was absolutely amazing. I don't think that I would have done that before any surgeries, but I was like, and it just made me love myself and everyone here so much more. To be here and to try and capture any part of this camp and to put it into a classroom where I have students that are walking in and feeling that they can be themselves and don't have to put up walls. The one thing about this camp is that a lot of those barriers just fall away. One of the things that Camp Firefly, from what I have witnessed so far, is really good at is providing a really intentionally designed experience. For youth leaders and for other volunteers, this is, um, first of all, for many of us, it's the camp we never had, right? So for them to come in and share some of their learning, that they've already had from maybe a few more years out in the community um, to uh, model that confidence, to model that sense of, um, I care less what people think about me now. That is really rewarding for young people to see and uh, it builds their, their resiliency overall. Coming here I see everyone who's the same as me but it's completely different stories that I had no idea even existed and it just, it changed me as a person because I'm seeing this being like, I'm coming from this area and being like, oh, you know, had a fit, like a good outcome and, you know, my parents accepted me, you know, had a great like family and friendship and stuff like that. And then I come here and it's like, yeah, I don't know my parents or yeah, this happened in here. And I'm like, how do I even like begin to put myself in that person's shoes? And yet they can come here with the biggest smile on the face and be themselves. It's so inspirational and amazing and just gives me so much hope and life and I love it so much. I didn't feel all the time that I was accepted or I was included and I had a very hard time finding people like me, especially in a small town. And I think this is a great camp for that, to show these people, these campers, that they're not alone and they're loved and they're accepted and there are people just like them. I hope they walk away with uh, images and stories and faces of people that will come to them in difficult moments um, and inspire them to, to do the right thing for themselves and their communities. I'm, I think my biggest hope is that they, even if they're, if they're going back to a community that they still, it's still an uncomfortable situation, they know that there are people out there that are, that love and support them. The moment I come out as trans to them or um, the moment that they find other campers that are trans or queer, it's this immediate connection of, oh my God, I'm not alone. You've gone through this too, um, which is just, which was one of the biggest impacts for me. And so I think it's really important um, to be like an advocate in a place where a lot of the time there's barriers put up um, and it's something really close to my heart and, and I couldn't imagine myself like, doing anything else. Camping for me wasn't an affirming experience growing up and I had a lot of uh, even some anxiety even coming to Camp Firefighter for the first time but being here has been just really affirming and positive and I think this is the sort of place where uh, the skills required for resilience and for really growing into healthy and strong, uh, not just youth but adults, uh, this is a really great place to get that grounding. I think other campers should come to Firefly because it's, it's life changing. Like to find a place so like out of the ordinarily comforting and the community and like everybody here is so accepting and loving of every single person. Like every single person is unique and they're made to feel that way. I think it's really important for medical professionals especially to be visible within the community. Uh, somebody who identifies as a queer person, I think it's very, very important to have that um, platform to make people feel safe going to medical professionals. I don't know, just like being in an area like this, just like in the space where it's like so open and like um, caring and positive and people here are so like patient and just kind like endlessly like, to like no like extent. Like it's just it's so like peaceful here and just 
full of like, positive energy, and that's exactly what I was looking for. So these youth have an opportunity to come to camp, uh, deal with the difficult issues around stressors and risk-taking in a supportive environment with caring professionals, teachers, nurses, social workers, counselors, and others, and then to really put an emphasis on, on making them agents so they think about where are the supports and how do I build the supports and then uh, how do I know that I'm doing better? What are the indicators of thriving? So a lot of these youth not only want to be agents in their own lives, but they want to advocate for other youth and it all starts with problem solving for themselves and making their own lives better.